So Mr. Briggs is going to take the embracing horse posture, okay? And um, I'm not going to nitpick it or anything on correction, uh, but the idea, of course, when we're doing embracing horse is to feel that connection to the body. Uh, what I'm going to do is just help him feel his ward off springy, like sitting on a beach ball sort of feeling, okay? And this is an indication that your whole body has become a unit, okay? And sometimes it will also give you a sense of um, accomplishment in your Tai Chi because it's almost like turning the switch on. So when you, when you, for the first time, when you feel like, oh, I touch on the arm, but you feel it in the heel, or you feel it in the ball of the foot, and you have a spring to it that you're not artificially creating, but it's just there, then you have ward off springy energy. Okay, so here we are. This is what I want you to do. He takes his uh, embracing horse. All the principles, head suspended, chest concave, lower back out, knees out, pulls in. So if I press, I'm going to just press on the little diagonal, and he's not, he's not going to collapse, so don't collapse the arm. Give some resistance, and allow the resistance to come through your whole body. Okay, do you feel that on the, on the left heel? Yes, sir. Okay, now here's the test for it. I'm going to let go all of a sudden, and there, there'll be a springiness in and actually both the legs. Okay? What? Do it again. Don't don't shift away or nothing, just be stable. So you press, he releases. Okay? Stay here again. I'm just gonna change the alignment a little bit. Is the shoulder okay? Okay. And feel sit back slightly more, let this hand come up more if it can as you sit from your Dantian. Okay. Now you feel the stretch through the finger. Okay, press. And I build up and I build up and I build up, resist, resist, resist. And then he relaxes in the dantian to the feet. There, there. Now I let go. No loss of balance, but uh, firmness. So if I, if I, I'm not gonna. You wouldn't punch someone on their arm or right at their arm. But just for sake of argument, his hand might come up on a punch. He's feeling it connect through his whole body, and that from here then he would do this. He would let your, his whole body rotate. Like let it whole, let the whole body just rotate, and it would come off to the side without actually him pushing with his arm. He would make contact and his body I would roll off of. And that was your opening move uh, in your Tai Chi form.